All right, hello everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you so much for being here. First of all, I apologize for this horrible lighting, but I wanted to keep it simple and cozy today. Um, and I don't know, it just really fits the mood. It's very autumnal outside and I lit this wonderful autumn candle here. And I felt called to just sit down and do a little timeless reading for the collective. So whenever you see this, I have very, very high hopes that this is meant for you, okay? And I believe that you're meant to receive this message. So, um, you know, whenever you find this, it is meant for you. So we're gonna jump right into the reading and see what messages the divine has for you okay if you want you can close your eyes take some deep breaths um if you have a certain situation or theme you know uh on your mind you can think about that while i'm shuffling and just you know ask for some guidance um wherever you may need it all right so let's start off the reading with an animal spirit card and then we're going to be moving on into the tarot cards as well. So let's get right into it, okay? Spirit, what needs to come through for the people who are going to be watching this? We have the Vulture Spirit. Nothing is wasted. Okay, you guys. So I feel like with this energy starting the reading, you need to know that... If you recently um, found your way out of a relationship or a job or whatever situation, you did not waste your time, okay? This time that you spent with this person or job or whatever, it didn't go to waste. You actually learned a lot from it, okay? You, um, you know, this person or the situation helped you level up, so it was not for nothing i feel like something you're stressed about something because you're like oh fuck like i totally wasted my time with this person i cannot believe it no honey like they brought you to the next level they brought you to your current awareness which you desperately needed you know and if this would have not happened you would not be on the certain level you are at right now you know so just know that everything, you know, every little just shitty moment that happened, it happened for a reason so you could actually get to the level where you are at right now, okay? Nothing is wasted. You did everything right and you didn't lose anything, okay? Like you have so much to experience and you have so much to make out of life. Don't think that it's all wasted now because it fucking isn't okay like you have so much time there's so many opportunities coming your way like there's so much waiting you in the future it's crazy so let's get into the tarot cards and see what else needs to come through for you guys Ooh, now that was fast yeah we also have the hermit here which kind of like really is in tune with the energy i feel for you guys you know something recently came to an end and you are currently in the process of yeah oh gosh you're currently in the process of releasing that and coming over something we have the five of cups here as well so you are still chasing after the past you're still trying to you know, get the past back for some reason. And Spirit wants you to really meditate on that and just know that it had to end. It fucking had to end because it didn't, it no longer served you, okay? It no longer served your highest happiness. And it just, you guys need to stop chasing the past. You guys need to stop chasing ghosts, okay? Especially when it comes to relationships. You guys need to, you guys need to spend more time in solitude and just know that you're exactly where the fuck you're meant to be right now. Surrender to this chaos, okay? Surrender to this fucking chaos. And then we have, we have the fall of one. So please 
fear not good times are coming your way because four of wands it's like celebration good vibes good energy good company okay good company um you know there might be someone in your circle celebrating something big or you might be the person celebrating something big there's a lot of magic and fun coming your way very very soon so hold on tight okay and i also feel like because we still you know have the hermit here it's like the universe puts you into this hermit mode and i don't really feel like you're there like voluntarily i'm not gonna lie i feel like you're like what the fuck like i feel so lonely like there's nothing to do um i want the past back you know and spirit is like no 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 you need this freaking solitude right now you need to be the hermit you need to do nothing for a hot minute you know otherwise it's not taking you to the next level right so stop stop trying to chase ghosts okay stop that right now and surrender to this hermit mode because because can actually be so beautiful it can actually be so powerful you know when you allow yourself to you know be the hermit for a hot minute and just you know allow yourself to care for your body care for your spirit care for your mentality you know just chill for a second so let's dive a little bit deeper and see what else needs to come through we have the seven of swords yes you guys you feel like someone or a situation but i really feel like it's a person stole a lot of your peace and happiness and you're trying to get it back and you're like oh my fucking gosh like i so 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 deeply regret the situation but honey no okay as i said it helped you get to the next level like it actually helped you grow so much so there's really really some deep shadow work that you guys need to do nothing was wasted nothing was stolen from you in fact you actually gained so much from the situation and we also have this uh the forest lord here right so whenever i see this card you know sometimes most of the time whenever i see this card especially in personal readings i'm getting the sense like that you're being protected by this kind of like masculine energy from the other side okay and i know that sounds very freaking woo woo but it's just what i'm getting and this this masculine person from the other side is like you did everything right you're exactly where you're meant to be you're fucking safe okay you have nothing to worry about and i'm here to protect you and i'm here to get you through this hermit mode through this hermit phase you know, even if you don't want to be in it, you will get through this. So, final messages for you guys. We have, yeah, we have the Four of Cups here and the Forge. So, I see you finally getting out of this bullshit. I see you finally getting out of it, you know, creating new routines and habits in your day-to-day -day life, which will really help you get out of this slump, you know, out of this, um, what's the word, lack kind of mindset energy, you know, you will finally stop obsessing over the past and you will finally be able to let go because I'm telling you, there is so much magic coming your way so fucking soon, like, you have no idea, okay, you, you really have no freaking idea yet, so just be open for that you know and surrender to this chaos okay because there's so much you know as i'm filming this i don't know when you're going to be watching this but it's so chaotic right now especially astrologically so just know that this too shall pass okay this too shall pass and we have strength here as the back of the deck energy you know you have all the strength it takes to get through this you have it all within you you don't need um you know you do, don't need anyone to find proof in that right you deep down you know you have the strength otherwise you would not be here today 
you know, you've come so far. And I also feel like you need to be reminded you have not come so far to just have come so far, you know? Like, there's so, so much that's still coming. Like, there's so, so fucking... Like, it's, it's crazy how much magic is coming, okay? But you really need to surrender and let go of the past. Because the thing is, if you keep holding on to that, how the hell can you be open for this upcoming magic to flow into your life, right? So make space for that. Make space and just accept where you are at right now. Even if it's shitty, you know, even if it hurts, even... If you feel like you will never get out of this, because trust me, like, life is so fluid, like, it's flowing all the time. You will never stay the same. If you allow uh, and surrender to the river of life, you will never stay the same. You will always grow. Your environments will always change. Everything is always changing constantly, you know, it's the only thing in life we can really rely on that there's always change, right? So, yeah, I hope this is bringing you some comfort, but overall, you guys, that was your reading. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being here. Um, and I just really hope that everything works out for you. And we are all in this together, you know, we are all just walking each other home and it sounds cheesy but i really really find some deep truth in that so thank you for sharing the space with me and i will see you soon